November 20th, 2015. I am Alexandria Houston and I am in Ms. Breton's second grade class. I am Emmanuel Wesley and I am in Ms. Breton's class. Grade two and three have collegial planets. Please stand for the Pledge of the Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for the which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Let us now say the school pledge. Today I will make a choice to have a good day. I will strive to be the best I can be. I respect all of those fellow students and myself. I'm accountable for my words and my actions. This is my responsibility to learn something new. I enter to learn and the Father serve. I'm a proud Kimberly Singers. Let us now say the no place for hate promise. I promise to do my best to treat everyone fairly. I promise to do my best to be kind to everyone, even if they're not like me. If I see one being hurt or bullied, I will tell my teacher. Everyone should be able to feel safe and happy in school. I want our school to be no place for hate. Please pause for quiet reflection. Thank you. You may be seated. The Elo Kimberly character word is Ernest. An antonym for Ernest is superficial. Today for lunch is Shelf's Choice. And now for a few words of wisdom. Good morning, Kimberly Elementary School. This is Mrs. Saunders with a few words of wisdom. Thanksgiving is a time when we give thanks for all that we have, the clothes that we wear, the food that we eat, the hugs and smiles we receive from others. So here's a holiday idea. Think of someone you care about who won't be with you on Thanksgiving. If you can, call that person on the telephone. Ask what she is most thankful for. It will give her a chance to think about what is good in her life, and it will give you a chance to get to know her better. If you can't call, write a letter. If it is someone special who has passed away, write down a list of all the things you appreciated most about that person. Maybe he was funny or maybe he helped you learn to read. Share your list with someone you love. It will give you both a special chance to think about all the goodness we can be thankful for. This Thanksgiving, be thankful for the good in your life, the good you can share and the good that is yet to come. With something to think about, this is Mrs. Saunders. Make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. It's good to be thankful for what you've got. And in America, there's a holiday that reminds you to do just that. Thanksgiving is the fourth Thursday in November. The famous first Thanksgiving was in 1621. Pilgrim colonists from England had just arrived in Massachusetts. They made friends with a tribe of Native Americans who helped them farm their new homeland. When it was time for the harvest, they got together to share a meal and celebrate their friendship. The spirit of Thanksgiving hasn't changed much over the years. Abraham Lincoln made Thanksgiving an official holiday in 1863, and he told people to take a day and think about all of the good things going on in their lives. Today, millions of people travel to be with their families and eat a big meal. And for weeks afterward, you get to be thankful for leftover turkey. And that's Thanksgiving. Our Thanksgiving break begins after school today. Remind your parents that we will not have school at all next week. We will see you back in school on Monday, November 30th. I can, you can, we can, bring our can good. Bring your can good today. Uh, bring your can good today. Bring your can good today. I can, you can, we can, bring our can good. Bring your can goods today. Bring your canned goods today. Show your kindness and generosity by donating your canned goods. The class that don't 
donate the most will win tickets to the Universal Soul, Soul Circus. Circus. If our school donates the most cans in APS, every student in our school will get to go to the University Soul, Soul Circus. Circus. I can, you can, we can bring our can good. Bring your can goods today. Uh, bring your can goods today. I can, you can, we can bring our can good. Bring your can goods today. Uh, bring your can goods today. Hi, Kimberly Panthers. Would you like to be a part of the etiquette club? Are you wondering what the word etiquette means? Etiquette is the customary code of polite behavior in society, which is in our world. Did you know that manners and etiquette for children is ranked as the most important quality to nurture in the family home? In the family home, this is where it all starts, where the manner seeds are planted and nurtured. This is where children learn not only good manners, but also core values, ethics, and good etiquette. We want to support your parents and help you grow into the young lady we know that you all can be. If you're interested in being a part of the Girls Matter Etiquette Club, please inform your teacher and then ask them to submit your names to Mrs. Cameron in room 236. The club will only be for third through fifth graders this year. We only have 15 slots. You must come highly recommended by your teacher or another adult in the building. Here's what the Etiquette Club offers to you. The Etiquette Club offers students opportunities to learn how to make a great first impression and confidently deal with situations that require social skills. Some of the topics covered include proper introductions, polite conversation, table manners, restaurant rules, setting the table, thank you notes, host, and guest skills and much, much more. If you want to be a part of the Etiquette Club, don't forget to tell your teacher so she can submit your name to Mrs. Cameron and get your permission slip. Starts next time we have tutorial. Looking forward to meeting you. Happy birthday to our Kimberly students who are celebrating a birthday today and next week. Happy birthday, Taylor, Lacey, Tyria, Darrell, Tere, Danielle, Zip. Kiria and Duane. Be sure to stop by the main office to get a birthday pencil from Mr. Sally. Happy birthday! Today is the last day for our book fair. This is your last chance to buy books here at our school, but you can still buy books online. Visit our book fair we website to shop all next week. Hello, this is your wellness ambassador, Tariqa Jenkins. Did you know that November is Diabetes Awareness Month? Diabetes means too much sugar in the blood. Teacher, for more information, please get an activity pack for your students near Wellness Board. Have a fabulous Friday at L.O. Kimberly Elementary School. And remember, be respectful, be responsible.